super easy recipe, a one bowl mix for the apple cider donut cake. That is a copycat recipe of the milk bar apple cider donut cake. If you're not familiar with milk bar cakes, you're gonna have to definitely check that out. But they are not vegan and that's okay because we're going to veganize it even better today. I've got my light brown sugar with some vegetable oil. I'm going to add a little bit of applesauce, which is an appropriate ingredient for an apple cake, but this also cuts back on some of the oil that I have to use in the cake. Apple cider, of course, and some plant milk. A little bit of vanilla extract. I've got some flour cinnamon egg replacer and baking powder and a little bit of salt. I've also got some shredded apples that I'm going to add to the batter. My oven is already preheated to 350 degrees and we're gonna bake these right away. Now this cake recipe doesn't dome very much, but we are going to trim off just a little bit of it because wait until you see what we're going to do with this excess cake trimmings. You definitely have to have these acetate cake strips to build this cake because we're going to be pouring that hot apple custard directly on top of the cake. And now it's just a matter of bringing this up to a boil on the stove, and that happens in a matter of minutes. So be sure to bring it up to a boil, otherwise that cornstarch is not going to activate. Then remove it from the heat and add a little bit of vanilla extract. And now to make that signature cake crumble that the milk bar cakes are known for. And I'm just gonna add a spot of that donut sugar buttercream. Just mix it up. It's basically like making a cake pop, really.
So if fall had to be described as a flavor, it would totally be this cake. Oh, you guys, this cake is amazing. This apple cake recipe is pure perfection and it is so easy. I am telling you, this is one cake that you are going to finish every last drop and then lick the plate. So head over to Gretchen'sVeganBakery.com to grab all the recipes and everything you're going to need to pull this off. And until next time, happy vegan baking. Bye for now.